Two riders top the leaderboard, equal on time, but that will change today. Welcome everybody to stage six of the final stage of the Santos Tour Down Under in South Australia. There, Robbie, is the uh, polka dot jersey signing in, the leader of the King of the Mountains, Damien Houston signing in. And it looks to me as though uh, these boys are going to be up to one big fight out of the blocks. And here we have Michael Hewitt and the mayor of the city of Unley getting them underway. Coming up towards the King of the Mountains. The first of three first category climbs. The other two are on Mount Lofty itself and we're on the circuit. Burns taking second across the top of Windy Point. Do nicely. 100 metres to go. Is Anyone going to pop sprint? out of the saddle? Is there going to be a sprint? What what reason? Ah, here we go. Ballast it. I'd have gone if I'd have been Stefan de Bon on the left. He's best placed. Three seconds have come off his 130 deficit. But it's not really going to be the case at all. It's Ballasted who's got that one. Yep. Maurice Ballasted, the. Yeah, well, Paul Sherwin, my co commentator for many, many years, um, and sadly passed away. He had. Uh, timings and figures all over the desk. Yeah. Always. So He's he had it had absolutely desk. perfected. <laughs> I only had handlebars <laughs> and I had figures just floating around in my head. <laughs> oh, over the KOM. There we go. And it's uh, Hill Gelders. And no sprint. No, no sprint. Hill Gelders from Sudal Quickstep taking maximum points over the FX King of the Mountains point. But then they are going to have to start picking up the chase. Mm -hmm. Stefan de Bod. In the pink, if I was different right now, I'd get out and win these three seconds because it could be crucial if it could, does go the distance, yeah. this breakaway, he would win the tour. And didn't even get amongst it, it was Jakobol Mosca who went across the line there. Quick step, the Belgian, who comes through to the front. So he'll take the points here, it looks like. A little sure? flick of the elbows, or, sure? oh, yep, just. Just got it, yeah. Just, but I, I think more the acceleration of Morgana, to me, looked like, let's try and race for the stage victory. Here goes Debord. There's crash a crash, race and there it is. Now, who's involved down there? That must have been near the back of the race, I presume, because it looks as though the contenders may have escaped, but there's where it's happened. Massive fall, really. Goodness me. A lot of riders caught up in that one, some 10 or 10 riders or so hitting the ground. Yeah. A lot of others held up, and that was quite far forward in the peloton. Around 20th position, there's bike changes going on here, so this is action stations for all the mechanics and team directors trying to service their riders and anyone who was high up on GC. It's a scramble to try and get back. And they can't keep up with the pressure now. This is the Santos Door Down Under, and a race for just one second could win the day. Well, there's the gap, Del Toro leading them. Bart Lemmer up there as well, and here comes Narvaez, so they got back on terms with the rider from Group Arm FTJ, Del Toro with the last ditch, Narvaez in... Bart Lemmer coming back from behind, they're in the last couple of hundred metres now, Phil, the road about to dip down, 200 metres to go, Del Toro, yeah, well, Williams here goes Williams. Go. Williams is going to go for this and take it out in style in the leader's jersey, he wins the stage on Mount Lofty, what a way to crown a winner of the Santos Tour down under, they're not going to catch him, he's got the victory in now that is class. What a tremendous finish by Stephen Williams there. The best man has won the Santos Tour Down Under. It has been an incredible week. Steve Williams, the winner of the Tour Down Under. How does that sound? Brilliant, yeah. Oh, what a stage. It's over the moon, honestly. The, the support the team have given me the last few days, incredible. Uh, I can't thank them enough. Staff, Swan Years, mechanics, the boys, the riders, everyone, Phoebe on the media. Just, uh, yeah, really proud to come down here, start the season like this on the front foot. And that finish is perfect for me. It's, it's so punchy. It's just, luckily, I was able to get on the wheel, back on the wheel, read the situation, and yeah, capitalised, opened up with like 250 to go. and. Everyone's legs was dead by then, so if I thought if I got the jump, then I'd be in with a good chance. What was your first emotion when you crossed the line? Oh, just ah, everything goes through your mind. Everything, just yeah. I mean, just you know how hard this sport is, and you know to to win races, they don't come around very often, and uh, yeah, to do it here in Australia, first World Tour race of the season is fantastic.
Del Toro ahead of Naves. Then Stevie Williams realised they lull momentarily around this corner and it's the opportunity for him to jump. And then it's all over to Naves to try and run him down. But unfortunately... Not enough legs there to be able to run down the Oka jersey. He wins the final stage and he wins the overall world tour of the Santos Tour down under to yeah. Stevie Williams. And he gets a 10-second win bonus to the six seconds of his arch rival there in red. Navies and the white jersey of Del Toro. He came back after his disappointment of yesterday, although he didn't sound disappointed when we interviewed him. He's a star of the future. There's the finish, and I think... Navier's just holds on to second place. The winner of the 2024 Santos Tour Down Under for Israel Premier Tech, Stephen Williams. come and of course the winner's plates for Stephen as well let's get that out shall we and let's hold that aloft ladies and gentlemen your 2024 Santos to it out on the winner Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome back out all of our Jersey winners for 2024. Isaac Del Toro Romero, the Zwift Young Rider winner for Team UAE, Team Emirates. The Zip Track Sprint winner for Bora Hounds Grower, Sam Wellsford. And the FX King of the Mountain winner, Luke Burns for the Australian National Team. Your four Jersey winners for 2024, put your hands together. Uh, congratulations, congratulations. Stephen Williams in the Oka, Isaac Del Toro Romero in the Zwift white jersey as the best young rider. Sam Wellsford with the zip track sprint and of course the FX king of the mountains, Luke Burns. Congratulations. What a great week we have had. We'd like to thank Interflora and the Jam Factory for the beautiful bouquets and trophies that our winners received today. Congratulations again to our 2024 winners. Thank you to the Government of South Australia, Santos, and all of the sponsors. Well, there we have it as the race wraps up. The Santos Tour Down Under for 2024, the Oka jersey, and the winner, Stephen Williams from Israel Premier Tech, the Welshman. He holds them all off, goes out in style, winning the final stage in the Oka jersey. 